Today I'm gonna show you how to um, transfer the files from Microsoft Excel as, as you can see here bottom see here okay. that it was an Excel okay and this is the data that we are going to transfer okay now here is the data okay um to show you I have this the copy that I have the before and then we're going to transfer here this one to the uh, uh, MS SQL Server 2000. So you click Start All Programs Microsoft Server, and then uh, click the Import and Export Data, and then uh, a DDS Import Export Wizard will pop up to you. Okay, the DDS means Data Transfer Automation Services. So click Next, and then. Um, just locate what kind of file is this so as you can see we have to check the uh, uh, pick or pick up the Excel 97 2000 so you can see there's no other than um, 2000 or Excel versions here uh, the most latest version that MS SQL 2000 server can read is the 2000 Microsoft Excel so we're going to click here so uh, make sure that your the uh, excel that you can import is um is created or was created in 2000 or 97 version there it is like this and then after it just locate where is the files so since we wanted this acer hardware database excel so just open it and then yeah and just click next then uh, um, this is the default, and you don't have to um, move or pick up the others. Okay, and then since I don't have any server, just go back. And then since I don't have any username or password, I will set it to user Windows authentication. And then the database, just pick up the database that you want. So I will pick up this Ace Hardware Store, and then click next. Okay, and then it will pop up here that you're going to transfer the Excel to um, SQL Server, and then just pick up this one. Okay, click next. Okay, um, this is the tables from uh, Ace Hardware, all right. And uh, what we want is the data. So since the data all want, all right, just click of it, or you can just click the both of them, and then click next. Then just click next, right? And then it will say, okay, just summarize what will be, um, what will be the output of the in importing from Excel to um, MS SQL. As you can see tables here, names is hardware data, the name of the uh, file of the Excel, and then we go into transfer what where uh, what database name where is it and then just create it okay, and then click finish and then okay as you can see it says successfully covered two tables okay from Microsoft so to server right just okay okay and then you're done and after it let's see check it does it work okay I'm um, just all programs server is the database that I selected here's the user table then as you can see just right click open it here it is then here it is so you can see there is the um, things that came from the Excel as you notice there is a lot of clouds here because the data that we imported is to, it has a lot of um, spaces so the uh, MS SQL consider it as a uh, no. Okay, just like that. Thanks for watching. Yeah. I'll